Wait. Florida doesn't have Common Core anymore. They've got the Florida standards for college and career readiness. And some people that say that's a rebranding of Common Core, but last February, the commissioner took 99 changes to the Common Core standards to a state board of education in Orlando. I went to listen, and there were many people there who spoke for and against and the board approved those standards. So last February we got standards that are about Florida and college and career readiness. We are still using those. And what I told the teachers in the video and what I told the principals this morning and what I said last night at the table, just to confirm, mm -hmm. I said I want to tell teachers and principals nothing has changed at the schoolhouse. You continue to teach to those standards. And um, the board agreed. I, I take on the responsibility very seriously that I have an obligation to be sure kids get what they need. And for the board to do what they did last night, have the vote they had last night, and um, knowing what I shared with them, which was the collective thinking of a lot of people, and knowing what the attorney shared with them, I have to question what else could I have done to have it go in a different direction because I, I said to them and I said it two weeks ago and I said it again last night I am in no way disagreeing with the general thought that testing has gone above and beyond what it ever should have been none of us has said we're afraid of accountability none of us has said we want accountability to go away accountability has been around. I mean I grew up in the public school system in Florida and we had tests from the time I was in first grade so this is nothing new it's how we delivered it it's the emphasis that's been put on it. That's why I do think it's the high stakes piece of it. And I do think there's an element that people are just tired of hearing that their kid isn't good enough. And so I think all of that together has created the emotional reaction. And I did say last night, if the group's goal was to make a point, it's been made because I know DOE is talking about it. I know legislators are looking at it. I know the commissioner is very concerned. I know the governor, I, if it doesn't become an election issue, I'll be very surprised. And so I thought they've made their point. Let's, let's go at the governing body that can actually do something about this. And I was hopeful that that's where they would go. And, and I was very surprised by last night's vote.